Hi, I'm David with Best Rest Products. In other videos, I showed you how to use the tire iron bead breaker to break a bead. I showed you how to change a tire using the components from the tire iron bead breaker. Now I'm going to show you how to use the donor hose to blast the side walls of that tubeless tire out against the rim so that I can begin to build pressure. If you hook up a regular inflator, the delivery of air is fairly slow. For a tubeless tire to blast outwards against the rim so you can begin to build pressure, you have to have high pressure. Uh, any inflator, including a cycle pump, can't necessarily be dependent on to give you that instant blast of air. So we thought about it and we said, well, we have another tire. Why don't we over inflate that tire and turn it into a high pressure air tank? So that's what we did. I've over inflated the rear tire to 50 psi using the cycle pump. Now I'm going to use the air from that tire to blast the sidewalls on this front tire so that they come in contact with the rim and I can begin to build pressure. The donor hose comes in a vinyl storage pouch. It's a very simple device. It's really nothing more than a piece of air hose with locking air chucks on both ends. I attach one end to the tire that needs to be seated I lock that in place. Then I go over here to the tire that's got the high pressure. When, once I connect this, we're going to get an instant rush of air from one tire to another. And we should achieve I can hear the movement of air. I can see the bead starting to swell, and in a moment we have a very satisfying pop as that bead pops into place. There's two of them. There we have it. We've just demonstrated how the donor hose can be used to blast the sidewalls on a tubeless tire out against the rim so that we can get the airtight seal and reinflate the tire. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the trail.